But then the real work began, the real hustle, because that second step, remember, is defining your audience. So we had to do a lot of legwork because the worst thing you can do as a marketer is think you know your audience without talking to your audience. It's the worst thing you can do because what will happen, you'll see in a little bit, change the perspective of what we did and what we created. So I went out and did parent interviews. I went out to preschool uh, PTAs. I went to preschools and I interviewed parents. I told them a little about our kindergarten program at the very end. I started interviewing some of them and gave them forms to fill out to talk about what their biggest concerns were about kindergarten. We did surveys targeting preschool parents through SurveyMonkey. Teacher interviews, because I really wanted to know, those are the people on the front lines, the kindergarten teachers, they know the complaints they're getting from the parents. They know why the parents might be leaving mid-year. They see what's going on in the classroom, so teacher interviews were vital. We started developing personas for certain people or certain uh, demographics in our neighborhoods. And at the end, I'll show you a link of how you can get all this stuff. And I put some personas that we've created in, in that uh, link that you can have. Um, but then we did round tables with teachers and parents so they could feed off each other, really find out the problems, and then phone interviews. So we did some extensive research trying to figure out about our audience. So from all of this, I pretty much found out a lot of pain points and aspirations of kindergarten or preschool age parents, what they wanted and what they were scared of. And a lot of things bubbled to the top. And we, uh, we thought, oh, let's talk about our innovative reading curriculum or how they're going to be learning math at an accelerated rate in our district. That's what the parents really want to know. But no, through these interviews, through these questionnaires, the biggest thing is they were scared to send their babies to kindergarten because of the basics. Where do I drop them off for carpool? I don't know. Am I allowed to walk them in the first day? Do they have naps? Do, do, they, do they do this? Do they do that? It was the simple stuff. What time do they eat? Can I bring their lunch? Can I sit with them at lunch the first week? They wanted to know the basics because they were scared. This is the first time for some of them to go into an established education uh, school. They wanted to know the basics. So we shifted from really touting, you know, our big reading, you know, initiatives, our big, you know, mathematical initiatives. We started concentrating at first on the basics through our content marketing. 